Hi, I'm Chris. In this short video I would like to show you how to publish our project. Let's say we have uh, prepared something we are happy with and uh, we want to put it on our server. Uh, I haven't chosen the correct size yet, so I'll, uh, let's say 100% is a bad setting for me and I want it 500 pixels wide and uh, 400 uh, pixels high. Oh, it seems quite correct. Maybe I uh, choose uh, background color like previously too. Okay, so uh, we go to export panel and uh, we have uh, some options here. First, save project XML file. This option is um, rather uh, not very healthy for us now because it's um, something like saving, uh, saving all project file. If we want to save it to open it later here, we use uh, this option. But if we want just to put it on our server, we may uh, export it for Flash or uh, for, for Flash or uh, HTML5 player. I'm personally, are, I am a Flash developer, so I will use this option. I click here, and uh, after a few seconds, uh, appears a window with directory. Put me on server. The name is <laughs> very. Uh, uh, it should tell you what to do. Uh, you just need to take these files and uh, put it on your server som somewhere. And uh, let's say uh, I used, uh, I actually used uh, file transfer, uh, transfer protocol client and uh, I have it somewhere. The next thing I need to do is to write the path to my server here. And uh, if I'll uh, do that, the embed code will automatically change, as you can see. After each change here, uh, we see uh, this window changing too. Let's say I just want it uh, tested on local host, so I just will write uh, index.html. And, as you can see, if I'll just uh, run this file, everything will work, but it will work in full screen mode. It will take all window. So I create new file. Uh, I'll name it uh, abc.html. It is empty file now. And let's take this code. I click copy. And I'll just put it here. Uh, it should be somewhere um, in a HTML file, so it should ha have some tags. Well, I'm, I'll copy my tags from Wikipedia. Okay. And I'll put this in body. Okay, so now I have a pretty empty HTML file with only the one line of body. This line is exactly copied from here. I saved it, saved it. And after running this file, everything works. It have uh, correct size and uh, well, it is done, actually. Thanks a lot and see you later.